Okay, maybe I should take off the yes, this is Uber. There's no such thing as Uber Trial Master. Okay. Beyblade Enjoyer is back for some more content with 100 Trial Master boss fights. I have actually never done this boss fight. I was um, preoccupied in Ultimatum League and then I played some hardcore SSF. So I didn't get to the Trial Master. So uh, we'll do his 100 Trial Masters. He bought it in bulk for one divine each. So this is a 125 div Gamba. Remember, he is up about 100 divs from the blues and the reds combined. So let's see if he can keep that streak or is he about to lose everything? If we don't get anything from this, he'll be down 25 divines. Hate Forge is apparently like 50 div. I don't know the drop rate. And there is some other interesting stuff like the helm that you can vol and turn into some crazy stuff. So yeah, I don't know how this boss fight is. We're about to like go in and try. Well, he's done with the league. Yeah, apparently. I mean, it's been uh, almost three weeks, right? No, it's like he's doing the, the content too. Yeah. Giga Chad. Giga Chad, yeah. Starting a new job, so it's time to get my life back together. So I'm quitting POA as it's by far my biggest time consumer. Thanks for the great content. Nice. Smart. Nice. Very smart. Congratulations and good luck with your new job. Well, let's try it out. The Tower of Ordeals. It has stuff that, uh, that was ultimatum like things on the thing. Anyway. I don't know. Let's I go. There's like affixes on the ultimatum encounters. Oh, there he is. The guy with the mask. Oh. Small man. Uh oh. Oh, he pauses the game like in the in the ultimatum league. And then he teleports out around and hits the ground. And then he dies. And he drops a map. And my service continues. Why can't I loot it? Is the loot paused also? Oh. Okay, he dropped a helm. Uh, oh, with alt, you can check the mods. A large cloud that deals chaos damage over time and will follow you. Runes will appear that will call deadly lightning storms. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go. Trial Master. Oops. Oh shit! I started the oh, thing. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Ah. Nice. Is that? That was close. That was a close one. Wait, wait. Sorry, I what was is the? Sorting my tabs. Master. What is the challenge? Collecting oh. all hostile currency. Oh. Okay. Let's let's try to do a challenge. I'm just not gonna throw any traps. Oh, I see a skull. Okay, okay, he's pausing. Okay, he's done. He's just randomly smashing the ground. Okay, oh, he has a Vol Orb here, Chaos Orb here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We click. Oh, yeah, we just click. Oh, what? Oh. Okay. Wait, so we can just farm this boss for currency? Just one, just one trap again. Try one trap again. Okay. Yeah. Okay, let's see if he smashes it. Spawn more. Oh, there's another yeah. heart here. No, it's just a heart. Okay, any more currency spawns? I don't know. Chaos, aid me. Is he gonna spawn a chaos? Okay, I'm he's not, not sure. spawning shit. Kill him. Just dead. Dead. Failed. Okay. Failed. Okay, here we go. Temptation. Click him. One, two, three, four, five. Boom. Okay. Now we kill. Complete. Nice. That's the challenge. Oh. Additional projectile. Oh. Why can't I loot it? It's like locked on the ground. You have to like wait like 20 seconds to loot it. Fine, I'll just do it fast. Ancient gloves? Wait, what's that? That doesn't ting? Bazooka's like, 
Hate Forge. Okay. I guess. GG. <laughs> what? How much is that? 90 divine. There is one listed. Hate Forge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> GG. Okay. <laughs> one. You don't even need to go nebulous. Then you just don't go nebulous, yeah, if, if you don't have like... I don't know, 80, yeah. 87, I think it's good to go nebulous. That's a lot of ink. Oh, Cortex drop, Cortex. what? Cortex, we need that. Okay, yeah, we, we do need that. Hell yeah. That's an unexpected drop. Cool. Why can he drop Cortex? The same reason he can give a uh, master mission. This is a map. Yeah, map. Apparently, yeah, this is map. a unique map. Old tomato. Okay, he's posing. Okay, last two. Glimpse of chaos. 15 aura effect. And finally. And that's it. One hate forge, five shields, many other things. Let's take out everything that isn't a unique item. Okay, let's see how many helmets. Yes. It's calculator time. Okay. We have found one hate forge, which is currently 90 divines min price. So there's five listed. They're all at least 90 divines. Ours is uh, it's like a mid draw. So we have that. We also have five shields, which are two divines without a tree. Let's look for it, because apparently Mahuksopl, this shield is cheaper because people already put like garbage trees on it. But if you want one without a tree, then you have to pay at least two divines. So that is 10 divines in shields. So this is a break even. Out of 100 maps, if you run them yourself and you don't pay for a carry, this is 100 divines. If you buy them in bulk, it's 100 divines for each. Or sorry, it's 100 divines, 400 maps. So this is a break even. And then this is uh, this is the profit. Um, we got a few shaper maps, few elder maps, conqueror maps, and the cortex. Cortex is nice. It's like 1.2 div, and then like another divine in other random maps. So we got two divines profit here, and then the vol scepter is 40 chaos, I believe. No, 20 chaos. We got four of those. That's 80. 80 C. Let's yeah, let's do chaos and then add two divines in the end. The ones are 40 mineral. What's the raw range on this? Absolutely nothing. Okay. Then uh, this one seems like it's 50 C. 40 to 50. Let's say 45. How many ones did we get? One, two, three, four, five. We got 12 plus four, so 16 times 45. 45, it will insta sell. That's 720 chaos. Plus boots. These are, they roll chaos res. Min roll is 5C. But if you're all like already mid-roll chaos res, it's like 10c. And then higher rolls is still 10c. Okay, I mean, we can count these as 5c. If you roll higher, it's gonna be more. But uh, yeah, if you do 5c trades, this is 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 boots, which would be 85 chaos at min price. It can only be more than this. Okay. And we got 
A bunch of glimpse of chaos. So this is the, the fun stuff. That is a lot of glimpse of chaoses. We got some aura effect ones. We got some charges. We got some mana reservation. You can do some cool vol shenanigans with this and uh, turn them into other helmets with those implicits that otherwise would not be able to roll. For example, an aura effect one is 80 to 100 chaos or one divine. If it's a um, max roll aura effect, then it's still 80 chaos. MP, you okay. have to make sure the quant, uh, not, not the quant, the mod is still on the helmet because you can vow the mod off. Right. Okay, okay, okay. Then any roll on these mods and max aura effect is a hundred chaos. Can be modified while corrupted. Okay, so the roll yeah, on the can. base doesn't matter. Okay, so this one is a hundred chaos. Uh, aura effect. We got four of these, so that's 400 chaos for the aura effect ones. What about skill effect duration? Bing, bang, boom. Any roll, any roll, any roll, any roll. That is 50c. Okay. We got a bunch of those. It makes it 60 chaos and then 100 chaos. I'm just gonna price this at 50 chaos each. So we have nine of these. That's 450 chaos. Let's do the charges. These are. 75 chaos. Six times 75 is 450. Mana reservation. Okay. The reservation one is one divine. We got a lot of those. That's nice. We got seven of these. So that's seven divines. Current divine price is 211. 211 times seven. Plus one four seven seven. Wow, that's a lot of chaos. All right, what about area of effect? Hundred C, zero point three divine. These are not really moving. It seems like maybe this one is. We'll value this at eighty chaos. Eight times eight, six hundred and forty chaos. What about curse effect? Fifty C, six of these, plus. 300 see so it seems like base price of this helm for like every other corruption is like 50 60 c 100 c for cooldown recovery rate oh okay actually cdr is nice cool down these are 100 c and then we got a couple of more oh quant oh wow okay quant one is six divine that's uh 1266 chaos more additional projectile wait a second what about that three divine for that one nice 633 wait we got another projectile another 633 plus two socketed gems 75 okay so the rest is 50 c each we got one two three four five six seven eight so plus 400 c Okay, plus we got two divines in random shit here, 211 plus 211, and that is our profit divided by 211, so 39 divines. So even paying the carry 25 divines, you made 14 divines profit if everything sells. Maybe subtract four if you don't want to do like the lower trades then say you made 10 divines without having to touch any of the content yourself wow some trading but if you run these yourself it's like a 40 divine profit for 100 if you find a hit forge that's a big if because if you don't goddamn, you lose a lot of money which that's how bossing is so now it's time for 100 Uber Cyrus. No, 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 no. Sure.